first half and kind of getting Ohio State on, on its heels. I mean, we had energy. Uh, the guys are doing their assignments right, fighting hard. I mean, making the extra effort to really uh, help everyone else on the team out. And, I mean, it showed in that first half. Is this the mood in the locker room? Is the feeling like you kind of let one slip away? Yeah, I, mean, I believe so. I mean, we came out, played probably our best half of football we played. And uh, we just didn't keep it together in that second half. What would you lose when you didn't have Chris on the field? What would you lose when you didn't have Chris on the field? I mean, anytime you got to play like Chris, uh, he's a leader, vocal leader, great player. And, uh, you always want that type of player out on the field. Is there anything you can pinpoint that they did differently in the second half to give you guys as a defense a little more trouble? Uh, I mean, not, not exactly. I mean, they just kept going. Uh, they got a good team. And, uh, they changed some things up at halftime, running running schemes, things like that. And uh, their, their players made plays. How big was the fact that Fields buying time in that second half? It seemed like that's how they were getting most of the stuff where he's scrambling around and somebody breaks open. Yeah, I mean, their first drive, uh, he had him at third and long. Uh, he rolled to his left and uh, escaped the pocket and found a guy going downfield. You know, it's just things like that. I feel like you guys showed something tonight, though, after what happened the first time you guys played him, the way you were able to, to keep it closed and have the lead as long as you did. I mean, I think this is just how what this group is and how we play all year. And, uh, you know, like I said, it was a great first half, just didn't keep it together.